Swiss researchers have successfully managed to develop a robot that can grasp objects thrown at it. The one and a half meter long robotic arm has seven joints and a sophisticated hand with four fingers. This is how it works. Cameras allow it to see what's coming its way. Based on the information, the arm's computer produces a mathematical model to represent the object's course. The robot then changes position extremely quickly in order to grasp the object thrown in its direction, like a tennis racket, a ball or a water bottle. We teach the robot uh, how to reach towards an object from many different directions. And at the same time, we also teach it the, the coordination that it needs to have between the arm and the fingers to be able to successfully catch, uh, catch the object. And we gather this data, we learn uh, models uh, which help the robot to, to predict this, uh, the optimal motion which will be successful in catching this object uh, for reaching towards it and also closing the fingers around it uh, at the correct time. Researchers hope their robotic arm may someday be used to grab and retrieve fast-moving space debris, whose increasing abundance threatens other objects including the International Space Station. Assume that the robot now is mounted on a satellite and it's tracking the debris and as it's observing this junk rotating then it can make inference as to what will be the next um, translation and rotational velocity, so where this debris will be moving next and adapt its orientation, the position of its arm, so that it can grab it and bring it back down to Earth. The researchers were inspired by the way humans learn by imitation and trial and error. The technique involved showing the robot examples of possible trajectories and then repeatedly guiding its arm manually to the projected target.